I just thought I'd throw in some jokes. Well don't. No one at home wants to hear about you pissing the bed or throwing up. I didn't say anything about pissing the bed. And in the umbrella section, why mention people eating dogs? Because they're made in Korea. Yeah, I know. All I said was, if it was raining cats and dogs, that should make a handy snack for them. That's not racist. I don't give a toss if it was racist. It isn't. What I care about is our Korean suppliers getting the hom pom because they think you're insulting them. It's just my umbrella wouldn't open, so I had to improvise. Anyway, they do eat dogs. But, Becky, you're good at this job. You've been doing great up till now. Just cut the jokes. You book a comedian, you've got to expect some jokes. I'll be honest with you, Ricky. When we booked you, we had no idea you were a comedian. Yeah, right. No, seriously. I mean, it's not like you're Johnny Vegas or someone. All his work is written for him. I'll be honest with you. We liked you because you look anonymous. Miss Nobody from next door. Someone that's not going to upstage the waterproof mattress covers. That is how I'm playing it. The point is, is that you're not a threat to anyone. No one's going to look at you and think, Oh, I wish it was her. Don't about that. That's how it works at the bargain channel. The other presenter's the sexy, attractive one. And you're sort of the trustworthy twat. Yeah. Thank you.